Gender-based violence is an everyday reality for too many individuals affected by crisis, particularly women and girls. IOM responded to the global initiative Call to Action to protect crisis-affected persons from GBV by committing to transform how GBV is addressed in IOM crisis programming. In less than four years, we were able to build up an understanding of the challenges, lessons, and emerging good practices from GBV risk mitigation, prevention, and response activities implemented at the field level. In September 2018, IOM launched its first institutional framework for addressing gender-based violence and crises, and missions around the world have worked tirelessly to better safeguard the safety, dignity, and well-being of all crisis-affected persons. Our conversation has shifted. We are no longer asking ourselves why GBV risk mitigation is critical or how we can contribute to the collective efforts to address GBV in crisis. We know the answers to these questions. The question we're asking ourselves today focus on how to scale up best practices so that GBV programming goes beyond immediate humanitarian response and how to keep the needs, ideas, and solutions of survivors at the cornerstone of our work. We continue to look for innovative ways to leverage our significant operational footprint and promote peaceful, respectful, and equal communities. While the learning will never stop, we now have a foundation for, that puts the survivor at the center and helps us to take action to protect people vulnerable to gender-based violence in all of our roles, whether we are a camp manager, a health provider, or a GBV specialist. We will keep driving forward and find improved solutions to pressing challenges by pursuing partnerships and engaging in dialogue with IOM staff and partners across the world. Our commitment to protect and support crisis-affected populations is stronger than ever.